In this video we're going to upload files to the server using FileZilla. It's not as scary as it sounds. Right here I have two ELD files for TradeStation. I'm going to go ahead and download these ELD files from an email. Now once I have these two files, I'm going to go ahead and open FileZilla and open the containing folder for these two files in my downloads. Now with FileZilla open, I'm going to go ahead and quick connect to one of my saved logins. Um, if you don't have a saved one already, uh, your host is your domain name. Your username and password have been set by me or by yourself. This is for TraderShark.com and here is his directory with all of his WordPress and all of his uh, folders. Currently we have a TradeStation folder already made. If you need to make one, you can right click and create a new directory, but we don't need to do that. So we're going to go ahead and go to TradeStation. Notice that it tells you right here your forward slash trader shark forward slash trade station uh, also here it's telling you um, where the location is as well now this is your server and this is your computer so what we need to do is we need to um, go to the downloads folder or whatever folder you're going to be getting your stuff from so my documents uh, and then downloads. And here's those two files I just downloaded. I'm going to go ahead and drag them into here. Now, let's see, this is T Shark 15 range. Okay, different date. So um, you don't want spaces, so I'm going to rename this file and turn the spaces to underscores. Underscores is a good way to create spaces in words and URLs. And then the second one is T Shark 3XMA. And the date. Okay, so these two actually look the same. So I'm going to rename the existing one to 1 at the end, and I'll name this new one too, or I'll just leave it without it because I really don't know what these are for. Okay, good. So now we have that. How do you get a URL from this? That's a good question. The easiest, most painless way to do this is to rename and control C to copy while it's highlight. Now go into your browser and then type tradershark.com forward slash trade station forward slash control V to paste the extension. Now I'm going to select all of this and then I'm going to hit uh, these are uppercase because I have my cap lock on TR. Now I'm going to select all of this and hit Control C before I hit Enter because when you hit Enter, it will disappear and it will download your file. Um, so now with that um, that URL, I'm going to go ahead and reply to you with the URL. Now the other one will be the same, but the file name will be different, right? So this one is the 15 minute range for 
10.1.11 rename copy escape and then I'm going to select this and control V and there are your URLs enjoy <laughs>